Hey there guys, my name is Marcus and in this quick like tutorial I will teach you how you can easily use relationships. So let me just teach you what you can do with it and how it actually works. So let's say that what you can do is to simply click plus add a column and then you're going to find something uh, called a relationship. And how does it work? So let's say I have a listing here. Oh, like property. Let's say I'm going to add a new task, which is going to be a new property with new client. Here, I'm going to simply click contacts and I'm going to add a potential lead Marcus relationship client. And we want to connect these two. So to this property, this contact belongs. What you have to do is simply add, uh, I'm going to add a complete new, complete new property. So I'll go like this plus here relationship relationship name is going to be property owner. And now related to you can have any task in your workspace or tasks from specific list. So I'm going to click here on a specific list. And here I see under real estate, we want to go to properties at column. And here I'm going to choose new property with new client. So this way I can easily link like to who it is actually, right? And property, I can simply come here and again, I can client Marcus relationship, right? And this is pretty much it, how it works. Now, uh, that's what you can do. And this is how you're gonna have client. I can also add a roll up. And the relationship can be contacts, contacts, client, tasks, dependencies. So I can have like, let's say task. And you would have a roll up, right? So this is something that you can do. But we, I will teach you how to do that in different video. So this is pretty much it. Thank you very much guys for watching. This was a quick video how we can use it and what you can achieve with it. If you can have any questions guys, ask me down in the comments. I'm really happy to help you. Then you can like easily click on it and then click on the client right here. Have a great day and goodbye. See ya.